So Sabrina, tell me, how did you get into art? What do you love about it? Now the reason why I brought you here is to meet a real archaeologist. Great! Awesome. So what things inspire you to write? Well, I've always just loved writing. So would you like to go and meet someone who's met all sorts of animals with their work as a veterinarian? Would you like to go and meet someone who knows a bit more about ancient Egypt and mummies? Yes. Hey guys. Yeah. Would you like to meet someone that actually builds computer games? We can. Yes. Awesome. Oh, That'll be epic. Let's go. Leroy, this is Annie. She yeah. loves animals. And uh, so I thought I'd take her to meet the bat expert. What kind of robots are you building? Well, we're building all sorts of robots. Right now, over here, Fred's building a couple smaller robots, which we call uh, First Tech Challenge robots. Watch this, it's gonna be really quick. Any second, gently put it near him. <laughs> oh! Whoa! <laughs> Art was the real standout. I knew that I wanted to do it as a profession and, and study it further because it was basically the, the one real subject that I loved. And uni just felt like the right choice. But this is made from bronze. Is it? <laughs> well, it's a really important object, and I can guarantee that you'll have one in your own house. Because it kind of goes like that. A tap. And it would have been used <laughs> like that. Ah, it's a tap, tap handle. This is a mummified head from ancient Egypt. Have you ever seen anything like that before? No. How do they see at night? Bats use something called echolocation. The university just took me so much further to give me the specific knowledge that I needed to create games, to do all the programming, and to just get an idea of how businesses work. By studying in a particular environment where the focus was just learning was a really beautiful experience. I loved meeting Ben because he's, he's awesome. He sort of inspired me to continue with this. Maybe I'll get there someday.